Yes. Earlier this week, Patrick Frazee was found guilty of murdering his fiance and mother of his child, Kelsey Barrett. Barrett went missing almost exactly one year ago. Frazee's guilty plea was due in large part to the testimony of an Idaho nurse, Crystal Lee, who he was having an affair with. Today, for the first time ever, the district attorney's office in Colorado released videos and pictures of evidence that show Lee describing the crime scenes. Our Misty Inglet is here in the newsroom to break it all down. Misty? Well, in court, Lee testified that Frazee had asked her to kill Barrett multiple times, and she also testified how just a few days after Barrett was last seen, Frazee texted Lee that she had, quote, a mess to clean up. She described that mess and her role in covering up the murder to investigators, walking them through each step. I found um, blood all over the floor. I saw blood up the wall. I saw blood on the lift wall. Crystal Lee, who had an affair with Patrick Freeze, walks investigators through Kelsey Barris' Colorado condo, describing what she saw after being told by Freeze to come clean up a mess. Lee describes a very bloody scene. There was blood on the front of the dishwasher. There was blood on the front of the stove. Crime scene photos taken from Barris' apartment also show what appears to be blood in between floorboards, where Lee claims she cleaned up blood. It also shows the couch Lee claims she wiped down. Can you point? to the area where you saw and cleaned blood. Lee describes cleaning multiple places throughout the condo and to taking bloody items with her she couldn't get blood out of. She also points out spots of blood that she intentionally left behind for authorities to find. Okay. All right. Other videos released are of Lee and investigators at Freezy's ranch where she says he burned Barris' body. This is where the, where the aluminum top was. And this is where the, the burn occurred. Lee points out a darkened spot in the dirt where the body and Barris belongings were burned. Lee also shows investigators dark spots in the hay in the barn where the body was stored in a black tote. And Lee helped dispose of evidence. The things that were thrown into the fire by me were the, um, the belongings from Kelsey's house, the curtains, the pillows, the stuffed animals, the um, cleaning supplies, the she describes all of the items plus the accelerants used by Frazee to start the fire and gave me Kelsey's phone and gave me instructions on what to do with the phone. Lee took it back to Idaho with her and burned it on her property. It was that cell phone peeing near Gooding that would eventually lead investigators to Lee. KTVB spoke to a friend of Lee's who describes her as a kind person, but Crystal's been fearful of Patrick for a very long time. She got into a bad situation and felt she had no choice but to help Frazy cover up the murder. Crystal had to. She had no choice. Her children were being threatened. Her life was being threatened. Her friends, her family, everybody. Now, according to Lee, Frazy beat Barreth to death with a baseball bat. He was convicted earlier this week of first degree murder, and he was sentenced to life without parole plus 156 years. Gretchen. All right, thanks for that report, Misty. And Lee has pleaded guilty to tampering with evidence. She is expected to be sentenced next month.